being strong or bold and having a voice in her opinion is yeah. quote unquote like a bad thing or wow she has an attitude or wow she's this she's that when like I grew up trying to like grab what's mine go after what's mine take ownership you know what I mean like like take pride and all that but it could be seen as like good and bad too same mm-hmm. thing I, th- I think um we value like all of those things but it has like caps on it like you can't be too much of these things you have to be like all here and you can't be too loud you can't be too opinionated you can't be too smart like or else like like if if you're the person who's constantly like raising their hand it's like oh she's annoying yeah (laughs) and it's like we 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 need to check ourselves in that yeah. regard because we don't need um to stifle um our ability to question um especially when it sparks our own curiosity or we simply don't understand what's going on very true also more often than not the best things about ourselves is usually the worst thing about ourselves like I would say my best qualities, like the my most attractive, whatever qualities are also like my downfall. Like the like the, the extremes. Just being just being kind of kind of an aggressive, bold personality. It's great at times, and then other times it's like, uh, oh, you just take a step back. <laughs> like, or I think, too I think far, I th- you know? Yeah, I think it all could be celebrated, to be honest with you. And not one way is the right way. Like yeah, I I have I've learned this about myself. I'm a very, uh, I'm slightly on the introverted side, but I'm also a low toner, which means that like my voice does not carry, but for some reason I surround myself with people who are so loud. (laughs) Like they live life loud. They talk loud. Like I, 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 for the life of me, uh, I mean, I just think it's like really interesting that that's the combo that's in place. Yeah. But when I do decide to speak, it's like very meaningful or it's like a funny one-liner because I've just been yeah. back, like and observing. And um, have you kind of noticed that in yourself and the people that you surround yourself with? Um, I would say just being a Japanese culture, I'll like whisper in the huddle and 20 <laughs> people hear me <laughs> and, and like being a theater major and like yeah. I was always into that type of stuff so I like can project and be expressionistic very easily I don't have to say many words for you to know how I feel which is a great thing and a bad thing <laughs> like mm-hmm. um so yeah like I would say my sister is the complete opposite of me even mm-hmm. though like we grew up in the same household and she's still very um, bold in some things that she does, but very like quiet and always kind of in the backseat. But when she speaks up, it like means something. And then I kind of like am just talk over her a lot. It's, yeah. <laughs> I don't mean to. It's just kind of like the <laughs> dynamic. <laughs> yeah, it is what it is. It's you yeah. being you. And that's, yeah. we, don't need, we don't need to apologize for it. 